Hey, Blair, did you set the magic word? I sure did. Of the day and the I didn't. Title? Yes. Chat's all geared up for some no. chaos and fun. <sighs> all right. Let's paste this again. Um. Wait we're going to be playing the first. this demo. Probably underscore Drew. You've claimed the throne of Chatland. Pretty Enjoy sneaky there, Drew. Pin that. With the tales of Iron too. There's a link Whiskers to the wishlist page, page and the demo adventures. of Mouse this space. game. I had to refresh. Yes, refresh if you need to. No worries, Nutmegrel. Sometimes a refresh is like hitting the reset button on snack time. Enjoy those pretzels and lemonade. Okay. Hellbound underscore hillbilly gives Flair a high five. That's eight times now. Excellent. Okay, we're going to jump right into it. We uh, just installed this. Flair's call for a refresh echoes through gotta, the chat. Reset those browsers and enjoy the chaos anew. Anti got a errors. game demo, and I'm not sure how long it's going to take to play. I need to kill the music. Megroll gives Flair a high five. Um, That's four times we'll now. we'll see. The first Flair, game of this was great. Shine. Welcome back. Ready to tackle the stream with us? It's narrated by... Um, What's his name? Doug Cock Doug Cockle, is that the name? The guy that did Witcher the guy that did Geralt in Witcher 3. Adjust the area to fit this fit the screen. Okay. That's an interesting way to do it. Adjust the brightness until the logo on the left is barely visible. I shan't. I'm gonna make it brighter than you want me to make it, because that's how I play. You bostage. Alright, United Label. God, bug studio the first game was so good um just it's it's very hard i'm if if the option is there for me i'm going to use of the controller is highly recommended does it work steam says the controller support does not work but we'll see all right the x button works settings controls Got that old kind of thing where um, the controller, it always thinks it. After these messages, we'll be right back. Like, this is not an Xbox controller, so these controls don't fucking help. I wonder if I do that thing on Steam where it's like. Um, Steam input next. Uh, gamepad. You like disable Steam input or something? No, it requires Steam input, huh? Okay, fine. Enable Steam Gamepad. Yeah, that's fine. Using Steam Input Translation. there like a community layout for this? No. Oh, we're just gonna have to translate. Move right, climb up, climb, drop, sprint, interact, move left, parry, heal, dodge. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Throw your timer balls. All right. Oh, no. No. <laughs> we'll remap move left to X. Um, this I'm using a PlayStation controller and it works great, but 
Steam loves to just map it as Xbox, and I'm just like, so the on-screen prompts are always like, I don't fucking know. What's A? I don't have an A button. Um, but since this is a demo, it's just they haven't implemented that. Extra. Back. Exit. All right, let's do it. Fairy tale mode. Yeah, we're going easy. Because this game is these games are hard. And it's like souls like, souls like hard. If you're playing on normal. In the north, they thought they knew all there was to know of war until the war of the rift. The war of the rift. While the southern king hid. Warm in his keep, the dark wings cut their bloody trail from frozen north to winter's edge. Alone, the warden and his small garrison turned their whiskers to the icy wind at the end of hope. In a last barrage, they wiped that kind from the land and memory. With no sign of the Dark Wings' return, in time, few believed them little more than a fairy's tale. But at Mount Cauldron, time had been all they needed. An old enemy claws free of their icy tomb and hungers for vengeance. But not wow. all is lost. King Rattus brings north a cause for hope. A bastard prince placed in the paws of the Warden of the Wastes to raise as his own a secret of blood never to be told. Now, fate calls for a hero in a murderous screech, and one young rat will answer. All right. Good start. Yeah, I remember I used to have to use, like, some third-party program to remap, and most of the time my DualShock 4 works on most games, but a lot of times it's hard to get the game to recognize it as such, and a lot of times it defaults to Xbox buttons. The stomp of his father's boots on the stair was how every Jump. began for Arlo. The booming shout to ready himself was louder still. Dodge. And such was Lord Eivor's zeal at a new day. Dawn was breaking over Winter's Edge, and Arlo was yet to miss one. Oh, I, uh, since it's a new stream, it turned that off. What are you telling me to do there, sir? Interact, X, grapple, X, jump, A. Move up. I think he's doing his best crisscross impression by telling you to jump, jump. No idea. Controls. Map. What the fuck button is this? Oh, there we go.
So this is better resistance against poison, but less overall. Same kind of thing here. And it's heavier. I'm just like dead in the water to poison with this gear on though. Well, we'll see how that... pans out. Probably doesn't matter much. You could temper it by doing like a mix. But whatever. Weapons. Okay, we've got an axe or a sword. Both axe for now. Items. I got nothing. Alright. Alright, we're gonna go this way. Quests. Beast Jerry. Snap. Alright. But X is square. Okay. The castle echoed with the horns of the returning hunters, bringing their knight's bounty. Harlow's little heart quickened to hear it. The only thrill to be found inside the high walls was a hunter's tales of what lay beyond them. So, that expanded my map. Okay. Arlo tells himself it's a good life here in Winter's Edge. <laughs> the bustling of contented rat folk, the crisp mountain air, and without the endless scourge of frogs the southerners suffer, why should he want for more? He says, go see the visiting, the returning hunters, but first I'm going to go the other way. Chief Mason Leaf was the rat Arlo most admired. As younger brother to Lord Eivor, his carefree uncle never faced the burden of being warden of the wastes. With walls this strong, his duties were light leaving him plenty of time for his nephew. Village, sun, wood, lumber, that way. Is that a quest that you've just given me, sir? No. Talk to this guy? No, same thing. It's, they like communicate in pictographs basically. It's interesting. That's how it was in the first game too. Usually pretty clear what they're getting at, but not always. Crunk was a <laughs> Crunk. with no interests beyond his forge. If you have the parts, this master crafts rat can make armor and weapons. That would see off a sky he wants some bite. scales of some so sort. He claims. Arlo wondered how well they All right. do against Let's do it. that wasn't a myth. I'm just gonna get wrecked the first fight I get into, probably. Arlo has no memory of his mother, but Hilda's food was a true taste of maternal kindness. A book with the right ingredients. She would make meals nourishing to body and soul. Tiki's shop was perhaps Arlo's favorite, as the shopkeeper had wares from far and wide. But getting him to part with his curiosities was never easy. 
There was no time for tales of the hunt today. Lord Eivor was already dividing what was an excellent hall. Happy to see his people provided for. Arlo longed only to join the hunt. To see the rectum, or even the lands beyond. His father called it a fool's wish. Arlo's destiny was unshakable, much like the keep. That would become his so go back to the keep. Life. Oh, and give go give everybody their share of stuff. Sure. Thumbs up. Proof of delivery for the goods. Give it to the shop. Hopefully they remember what when it comes time to trade. All right. A meal. Alright. Receipt for the cooking ingredients given to the sheep. Chef, good warden, lover that never lets kitchen supplies run low. Well. Receipt for the lumber delivered to the builder. And this is like the forge. Tink, tink. Wood helmet. Less weight, more poison resistance. Okay, I see. Um, I don't want to equip it right now, though. I don't have the logs for it, but that's okay. And then there's, like, upgrades. Okay. Shield. Nice. I get it. Weapons. Spear. Bone spear. Wood spear. I have a sword. So the bone sword is less, but it does like electric damage. The wood sword is less, but it does poison damage. Okay. The stacks I'm using, a little bit less damage, less weight, electric damage. I think I might go with that. All right. And then... Okay, so that it seems to be like the general quest marker. the thing, daddy. Hunter cap. Less resistance, less weight. Poison. Sure. Hunter armor, that's better all around. All right. The hunters had brought unwelcome news. Their family of the reviled creatures Radfolk called backstabbers had moved into the wastes. Eivor told his son to fetch his weapons. World map.
Okay. Bone axe, iron axe. Hunter's cap. I th don't think I want the hunter's cap. I think I want, well. I think this is all good. Quests. All right, let's go. It's like a save point. Yeah. Traveling. All right. Time to get wrecked by the easiest of enemies. a little his father had no explanation for suddenly taking Arlo on a hunt it even gave the hunters pause Arlo had been taught to fight and better than most but rarely had he been tested he was determined to prove himself the rugged terrain of the outskirts could have taken all day to traverse but Arlo's trusty grappling hook allowed him to swing between its many crevices. Yeah, how do I use that? Ah. Oh. Nice. Backstabber. This rabid creature uses the quills that run the length of its back and can be fired to defend itself. When curled into a ball, it's able to move at blistering speed. Okay. The art in this reminds me of another game. Arlo liked the feel of a sharp axe cutting through the vines. The wilds were part of his home. And nothing in them would frighten him. Do you know what game? Darkest Dungeon. Oh, really? I haven't Couldn't played that. Remember the name. Hepbridge Farm remembers. The frostberry bushes of the wastes were in full fruit already. Their juice made a healthy tonic, though Lord Eivor preferred them fermented. Yeah, it's very similar. Copper ore. Hmm. Oh, I fill up my potion, I see. His father was a sturdy rat, built for strength, not speed. So Arlo found it curious that he challenged him to a race. The prospect of the hunt had filled Lord Eivor with a vigor that his son had not seen in years, or at least since breakfast. <laughs> Checkpoint. 
Oh. Whetstone. Lord gifted Arlo his own sharpening whetstone. Okay. Weapon sharpness. Okay, I see. Whether these beasts were named for their spines or for some past unforgivable deed, no rat knew. Either way, Arlo was about to find himself at the pointy ends of this brood. Even young backstabber red attacks were brutal. But a well-timed dodge would see Arlo escape unscathed. I don't know what button is B, sir. Yeah. This backstabber lived up to its name with its deadly white attack. But Arlo's shield could block the deadly spikes. Young one used vicious yellow attacks. Arlo had to time his parries perfectly. Parry. Oh, that was supposed to dodge that. You die. Increment deaths. Remember how to judge the like. Oh, that was a dodge one. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Increment deaths. I gotta remember the, the cues. 
The red is dodge. The yellow is parry. Nope. Nope, I'm dead. Increment deaths. I still have it set to hunt mode where it's like deaths and assists and stuff. Hunter sword. Less damage, less weight, less sharpness. Why would I want that? Um, let me see. Fix my thing real quick. Uh... There, now it just shows deaths. Okay. Thick tide of the backstabber brings toughness to your armor and weapons. So this is stuff I could probably use for, like, upgrades. Treasure Hunter X. Okay. It's like about the same as what I'm wearing, but. or what I'm using, but more electric. Sounds, sounds good. Shield, less weight, more defense against electric, less resistance. Nah. Cool. Loot. Save. All right. Arlo basked in his father's pride, almost as warm as at the fire inside winter. So edge. the berries like refill your flask, I think. So if I use it, yep. Can I break this barrel? Yeah. Noise. The hell was that? Oh, I see. stuff all right now what traveling <laughs> triumphant and keen to tell the tale of his son's victories Lord Avor set to a night of drinking with the elders Right. Meanwhile. No. Fine. These games are good. I, there's, 
it's it's just uh i'm not particularly good at them because i but it's one of those things you just like you gotta learn the move sets and learn the enemies and it's not that bad once you figure it out but a bit of fussing about to learn is that what i'm, I'm meant to just go to bed i guess we should go check out the revelry first Cheers his, cheers his dad. There you go. Just stand there and drink. Am I getting drunk? Yeah, the, really like the room's style. starting to spin. Yeah, the art style is wonderful. Look at the little band of bards up on, a, on the balcony. Little, little rat bards. All right, get wasted. Arlo was reluctant to return to his bed, wondering how long he must wait to hunt again. The booming footsteps that woke him this time were nothing like those of his father. Uh, oh. What is B? What? Locked. Piercing fang of the bat that would suck the blood from the victims could be put to better use in your armory. Snout which smelled out of their prey offers minimal crafting benefits but used as trophies proclaiming your victory and strike fear into the black hearts of the darklings. Okay, so I got bats attacking. That's a no go. He had found his father. The warden stood alone, holding back a whole dark wing army. Their cruel Count Kazak leading them. Oh no! His father charged, but the dark wing oh, Count was as fast as he was strong. The winter's crown tumbled to Arlo's feet. Now, without a head to rest on. There was no time to grieve his father, as from above the Count revealed his greatest weapon, a Sky Scorcher. Not a fairy's tale, but an undead beast whose very breath could level kingdoms. Oh, okay. I was trained on Arlo. All huh. that came next was a fog of bloodlust, snapping jaws, and the beating of leather. It's like rings. scripted death there for sure but there could be no victory arlo awoke groggy and warm to his father's shouts only he wasn't in bed the warmth was from the fire that had engulfed winter's edge and the shouts were his uncles the only other burnt axe all right attack. leaf was bruised and his hind paws barely steady he'd seen villagers flee to the outskirts Arlo knew it Let's try the sword instead of the axe. I think I'll be more fun. Now I'll have a little bit more fun with speed then. Can I go back in? Is there anything worth 
getting up here. Probably not. I'm like, I always go the opposite way that the quest tells me to go, because I'm like, there must be something. Alright, well... More buddies. You want the fish tank on? Okay, I'll be right there. Hold on, my buddy's up. Well, I'm going to run to the bathroom while ads run. Hold on. I'll be right back. Welcome, ladies, gents, and envy friends. Enjoy the chaos. Ads incoming. Folks, time for a quick snack or a bio break. Don't go anywhere. We'll pause the action for you. Okay. Time's up. Let's see if Flair has returned. But yeah, Little's these, virtual these thumbs. games are gorgeous. Um, I watched. Let's see. I watched Cujo and um Rev play the first one, and I played it myself. I, and um, yeah, I didn't even. I wasn't even aware that this, there was a second one coming out until I saw the demo. Who is it made by? Um. It's Oddbug Studio and the Publishers United label. Um, they've done. Let's see, there was a game called This Land Is Ours for Oddbug Studio. Otherwise, it's mostly Tales of Iron. Tales of Iron was really good. There's a there's a DLC as well. I wonder um, who did the art. And then the the um, publisher has done a lot of stuff like pixel pixely type stuff, Galaxy Land, Brains Not Brawn, um, something about the Eldest Souls, some Wasteland Roki. I'm not honestly familiar with any of their stuff other than this game. Um, yeah, I'm curious. I don't know who... 
wonder if it's similar artist to the other game. Is it telling me to go in here? Or did I just go back to the castle? Whoops. Let's see. As always, we'll try to go left first. No. He's dead. Poor guy. Poke catch. No, nope, stop. Know these anywhere? Kronk's smithy hammer Oops. and Hilda's chef's knife. Are the wondered why they would leave them? I keep accidentally entering the town. Was this a burnt spear? Ooh, I did want to try a spear. Let's try it. It's nothing like a little reach. Should I go down or should I go up first? Ow. Yep. I think I probably should. Winter's Edge. No hunters had come to check their traps. Harlow thought he might hmm. find a use for them. Yeah, for sure. I think I need to go back and check that cave. Doesn't look like I can break through this. It might be one of those things that's like, uh, I need a stronger thing to break that, like a little bit of Metroid, Metroidvania type. Or my weapon is just so dull that. Nope. Oh. Alright, let's go. Oh.
Now. Butthole. I don't know what that... Oh, that was like a finish it move with the right stick. His foe was beaten. Nice. But seeing what had been inflicted on Hilda and Krunk, Arlo's need for vengeance... Hilda and Krunk. the demo very fun yeah so instead of like all the frog enemies it's gonna be bats yeah it's just a it's just a short demo um that's it not enough games so I'll look at the store page and see like when uh when it's actually uh, available. Um, it's hard to say. Store page. Coming soon. You can wish It's definitely going on my wish list though, for sure. Um, it was part of the demo was part of the next fest. Wet stones will act more like weapon buffs. Increase. No. Calm down. Desktop mode, please. So, watch the video. Um, similar to games you played, Elden Ring, Hogwarts Legacy. I don't know about that. The demo's only been out for like half a month. They came out for that next fest thing. Um, shows like a bunch of, there's like sandworm, huge bats, the porcupine, some kind of like snake. Very cool. Um, it's very, um, I, I like the combat. It takes me a long time to get into these kind of, in, into the rhythm of these these kind of things, but I I, always, I liked it a lot in the first one. This one has like some kind of upgrading of the settlement stuff like that. Um, companions, things like that. I'm trying to find like a, a release date. 
June 24th. This came out. Demo extended. The demo is only supposed to be live for the duration of the next fest. However, due to the overwhelming response, demo period has been extended. Cool. Um. Six biomes to explore, animal factions to discover, open, a little bit semi-open world. I added elemental effects to the original game. Giant monster hunting side quests, base building, day and night system. So there'll be like nighttime monsters and daytime Hunt monsters and stuff like that. Hunt is mean, catnip. Um, well, I finished my demo, so I may be up for some hunt. That's already pretty late. I will be playing hunt tomorrow. For sure. I'm trying to find, let's see, maybe on the community page. I'm trying to find if there's a, I've just got kind of a general coming soon. Next fest. Sharpness mechanic people don't like. I would prefer that Hunt steal my weapons and leave my hunters alone. I'll be working <laughs> T. T. Losing hunters sucks. Yeah, you get used to losing hunters. I basically like... The legendary hunters only cost 100. And they come with um enough trait points to give you like some stuff you can reconfigure the trait points enough to give you like necromancer and resilience or a couple things um but uh you you lose every hunter you bring in eventually you just it just how it is <laughs> Feedback with easy. I played the demo. I'm worried. It's a good thing that sharpen your weapon mid combat or you do no damage will be chopped. But second proper boss hits hard, has phases for summoning minions. You don't fight the boss and the minions at the same time, which is good. Combat feels off. Yeah, there's a bunch of bunch of feedback and stuff. But I'm trying to find like any sort of release date. Let's see. This story it just says coming soon. I finally hit 11 with Cat just now, so. Noise. So now it's time to die. Tales of Iron to release. Oh, I'm also going to stop the poll. Let's see. Now that I've beaten Dave the Diver, I'm going to lock this in. Let's see. Back to poll. How do I... Poll settings, results, design. How do I end it? Show results. Back to pull, share. I don't want to reset it, I just want to end it. Close on a scheduled date. Huh. Status live. Let's see how 
do I end it? Pin code. Weird. I don't get it. Reset, embed, share, export, invite, pulse, edit, pull settings. Well, anyway, this was really cool. Let me look. Um, I was going to look for a uh, release date really, to Tales of Iron. Um, Tales of this Iron 2 scheduled the release in 2024. So, soon. Game released... This voice is okay. Hard to say. This voice is okay. It's uh, Whiskers of Winter, so maybe it'll be released in winter, but... Game prepares to launch later in 2024. So, sometime this year. Very cool. Um, That will be fun. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to close this poll. Voting. Oh, close poll. Here we go. Save. So, we have it. Our results of the, the next game poll are locked in. We got Night in the Woods. Let's see if I can get this whole thing screenshotted. So here's the results. I'm going to put them in Discord. But this will define the next few games, which is cool. Um, my schedule is going to be pretty hunt heavy in July. There's drops from, um, Let's see when there's drops from. Have you played any of these games already? A few, yeah. I played Firewatch, but I told you about that <laughs> the other night. Um, I've played Cyberpunk, I just, but the my thing is for the the DLC. I haven't played The Outer Worlds. I haven't played Night of the Woods. Um, I played Firewatch, and I remember liking it, but I don't remember the game at all. Um, so I wanted it, and I know it would be a good one for stream. Phantom Liberty, I've heard good things about. Sam and Max Hit the Road, I've played. It's like a 90s uh, point-and-click adventure game. It's like an old Sam and Max. Grounded, I'm playing with my kids, but it would be fun to do a game on stream. I haven't played the DLC. Um, I tried playing through Cyberpunk again, and I hate what they did with the skill trees. I'm not trees. sure what they did with the skill trees, but... I liked my playthrough. I played through Cyberpunk like maybe I, when I first started streaming on this account. So it was a while ago. Almost, probably almost two years ago now. Bastion I played and never beat. Black Side I haven't played. Dark and Darker I haven't played. Night of the Rabbit I haven't played. Call of the Sea I haven't played. World of Goo I played when it was new. Everspace I played in early access for 10 hours or so and liked it, but didn't continue. But I made this list as these are all games that I would be very happy to play on stream. So otherwise, I, I wouldn't put something on a poll that I didn't. The only one that was like a little trepidatious about was Dark and Darker because it's a lot like Hunt where it's like brutally difficult learning curve kind of thing. But yeah, so it'll be Night of the Woods and then Firewatch and then Outer Worlds probably um so definitely night of the woods will be next 
whether I do these the rest of them in order isn't it's just we'll see how it goes. Is um, night in the woods scary? Um, not really. It's like sh not sure how to describe it. I don't really know. It's um an adventure game. Um, college dropout returns to returns home to the crumbling mining town to seek to resume her aimless former life and reconnect with friends. Things aren't different. Leaves are falling. Winds are growing colder. Strange things are happening as the light fades. There's something in the woods. Yeah, it's like I'm I don't know. Of a when it comes to scary stuff, so hopefully it's not too bad for me to watch. <laughs> Um, it's like cartoony. It's not like charmy and melancholy, but I don't know about scary. It's a world of cute animals talking about what it would be like to burn down their room with themselves inside. <laughs> what up, Rev? They were streaming Elden Ring. Looks cute enough. Dark. So I think it's like dark, but also cute i've heard very good things about it I'm gonna have Lynn and She's way better in history. what up Rev? thanks for the raid if you seek the tribunal let death be your guide from what is behind death but murder so um sounds like it'll be good so that'll be next you know what i got, I got this doom i know what we do ready what? Hold, i'm trying to read this hold on and then firewatch most likely after that but yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's up, Rev? <laughs> How was? Were you playing Ogre or whatever? Tactics Ogre? Boo, 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 boo. Rev. Right on. How was the rest of your stream? Oh, you moved on to Elden Ring. Nice. So I did, um, I finished Dave the Diver, and then I did, um, uh, I played this Tales of Iron demo. Gameplay mode, please. Tales of Iron 2 demo. It was pretty fun. It's a very short demo. But um, it was good. So what if Dick Boulder? Not much. Of, you know, hit my like next level dumb, cap in Tactics Ogre, so I have to grind off stream like, to hit the level cap. Fair. Then I hopped on the seamless Viagra, mod of right? Elden Ring for a bit. So you, uh, my build up seamless mod is working my again. And got my character for Doom and Flair's coop game to the Vars Grace. Welcome, raiders. Enjoy the chaos. Grab some snacks and let's get wild. Well, hello there, Revan and Sorrow. Hope you're ready for some sarcastic bod banter today. So, nice. yeah, Sounds I'm just like about to wrap stream. up as well. Grinding off stream is the way to go. Any cool moments in Elden Ring with the new build? Yeah, Seamless Mod got its update this morning. Perfect. So I will be, um, Sweet. let me get Updated set up to mod. stream. Sounds fun. Anything you found that particularly game, let's cool see, I was going to show what's my schedule. Update? Um, so my schedule tomorrow, I'll be doing Hunt, uh, with Orchid and Crazy Little. Um, I, I believe that's still the plan. I have, well, I will check in tomorrow during the day to make sure that's still, but I'll be doing Hunt either way. Um, and then Friday also, I will be doing Hunt. Next week, I will start, um, Night in the Woods. And that'll become my um, my Sunday game for a while. But since there is drops in mid July for Hunt, I'm gonna be doing like I'm gonna be playing Hunt every night that there are that I am scheduled to stream and the drops are live. So that I'm gonna that'll in include one Sunday. So I to make up for that, the weekend before and after the drops, I will be just playing night night. Night in the Woods, 
and not doing hunting on Mondays. So I'm gonna try to um, grind out resonance of fate, but if it gets a little rough, I might take a day off and play something else. Grinding is always tough. Resonance of fate can be a beast, but breaks with a different game might keep you sane. So Happy let's gaming. see. Tomorrow. Let's see. June. Why does this say June 30th? That's weird. So yeah, hunt tomorrow, hunt Friday, and then next Sunday I will start. Next Sunday and Monday, the 7th and 8th, I will be playing Night in the Woods. And then that Friday, that following Friday is when hunt drops start. Um, uh, so that Friday and then that Sunday and Monday and then the following Friday will all be hunt. And then after that, I'll be back to Night in the Woods for a weekend. And then the week after that, I'm on vacation. So we'll we'll see. But I, I should be back from the vacation for... I'm going to miss the streams on whatever it is, the 28th and 29th. But then I'll be back at the beginning of August. So my schedule is up, up to date in... Uh, in Twitch. I just don't have the game announced, but now that it's done, I know what it is. Night in the... Nope, not Nightingale. Although that's on my wish list. Night in the woods. Save. So we'll get that updated and that'll be cool. I'm excited for that game. I don't know a ton about it. I know it's like kind of dark and, but it's also like really cute. <laughs> um, so it's one of those, going to be one of those games. I've heard good things about it. It's giving me Cult of the Lamb vibes. Yeah. The art Definitely style has for that sure. Cozy yet dark vibe. Perfect for cuddling up with your plushies in a warm beverage. A warm beverage. I could use a warm beverage. Okay. Desktop mode, please. Meh. Hey, so Flair. yeah, I'll Welcome post this back. up and if I'll get my graphic me, let's dive my back into schedule, the assets and stuff all sorted out. Warm beverage. It's Desktop summer. mode, please. Warm I live in the desert, so it's still cold at night, even in the summer. Um, in the late evening, it's still sh hot as shit up here in my loft. But by this time of night, it's already like. Okay, I mean, I'm fine. I'm wearing a tank top, so it's true. it's not that cold. But you know, anyway, so it's gonna be hunt for two. Hunt tomorrow and Friday, the night of the woods, so night of the woods. And then hunt, 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 while there's drops. Um, got a bunch of new friends playing hunt lately, so, um, cat with catnip and bolt playing. Nutmeg started playing again. We've got a lot of people that might be, might be able to join. Tomorrow I have, I'm scheduled to play with Unknown Orchid and Crazy. Um, but then Friday I don't have any like partners scheduled so if anybody wants to play on friday i will be i'll have open lobbies otherwise i'll be soloing my solos on friday this week were just like it was my best night of soloing ever it was great i had a lot of fun um i'm trying to decide if i want to play a couple games now or not i think i do so i might switch to hunt for a round or two because it's still it's not it's not end time yet. Um gameplay mode please. So I will do that. Here. I'm gonna run to the bathroom first. Change game. Uh 
Um, I'm gonna take the dog out while I still have energy. Flair is diving into hunt, showdown, ready to hunt some bounties in this intense multiplayer shooter. I'm going to quickly stop and hunt. start stream. Showdown. I want that VOD yeah, that for the like Tales of Iron 2 Packard demo to be its own little VOD so I could submit it.